I've been an Xire Pro user for a couple years now, and I'm very excited about the new version 2.0 and its speed improvement and its new facial recognition feature. Hey, this is Scott Weinkiewicz, a storyteller with a camera, talking about all the things photographers like you and I are thinking about. And in this video, we're talking about Xire 2 Pro and finding the right people. Find somebody with their face on other photos in your entire catalog. It's kind of like what Lightroom has built in with their people finder, except you can actually fine tune and say, find this person's face with this keyword or this person's face with multiple people or a single person or two people, and then also add it when this, when when a specific color is found. So we're gonna dive into Lightroom and open up XR Pro 2.0 and their new people finder and see what you can do that Lightroom can't do on its own. Let's say you want to find a photo that's in your Lightroom catalog. You know, Lightroom's facial recognition for their people search, their people browse is, it's okay. It's not amazing, but it does a decent job. So that's where XR Pro 2.0 can really come in handy is finding people really the way you want, and they can do it in your entire catalog and super fast, like really fast. Here I am in a collection which has, it's from a client, and it has almost 20,000 photos just in this one collection. So I can go ahead and hit library, plug in extras, and then search for people. And what's gonna happen is this dialog is going to appear. You can see it recognize the face. And now I wanna find similar faces, right? Sim filter by face, I wanna find similar with if I want eyes closed, I can do that. But I really, I want eyes open. I don't care about smile or no smile. M many times he is not smiling. And then I can filter by face count. If I want just him in the photo, if I want three faces, a group of faces, two faces, things like that, I want one face. Then you can select keywords that you want. I'm not gonna select a keyword for this, but you can actually fine tune if you want to search for a keyword like red, which will probably find it any ones of him in front of the banner because the banner has red in it. And then now you can search the whole catalog or you can search just the film strip. In this case, just the film strip would be this collection with just shy of 20,000 photos in it. So I'm gonna do film strip just so it's even a little bit faster. And then you can set how many photos you want to be displayed. I'm gonna say 120 for this purpose. And that's gonna override the previous results, which means that the Xire search collection that is created by this Lightroom plugin will actually be updated with these photos. And I'm gonna hit start. It's gonna take a second and it's going to update with photos based on that criteria. And you can see it has another photo of him in it. Single face, no smiling. So what we will do is we will go back to library, plug an extra, search for people. It's gonna bring up that dialog box and I'm gonna say any face and I don't care about the eyes open or not. Actually, yeah, let's do eyes open. Any face, I don't care about the keywords. Let's search the film strip and let's see what comes up this way. You can see we've got more photos now with more than one person in it. And here you can tell it's the wrong people. This one you can tell it's the same person and this one you can tell it's the same person. So yes, you can get a lot of good results from Xire Pro 2.0's search for people feature. It is more fine tunable than Lightroom's built-in facial recognition feature, but this one you can actually get quite specific about how you find the results. Like if you want to base it on a keyword like color or text or writing. Now the keywords will actually come into play from Xire Pro. Most of the keywords will come into play from Xire Pro when it imports the photos, you can make it so that it creates keywords on import automatically. So you can see here, colors, eyes open, face, frontal face, and then adult, beard, bright, and brown, right? It's all in here, one face, person, sepia tones, and then there's somewhere I added, like the Karate Studios name, Karate, uh, New Jersey, and then the person's actual name. So there's some that Xire Pro has created and there's some that I have created. So what do you think about Xire Pro 2.0's new people finder and that facial recognition feature and the fine tuning with the, with the keywords and all that cool stuff that you can do, the colors, it's so cool, I love it. Comment below, let me know what you think and I'll look forward to seeing you in the next video.